What was the name? Miss Girl. Miss Mom. Knees. Miss. Head, shoulder, knees, mole. Mole. Knees, mole. Oh, I got it, got it. Okay, okay, bring it, bring it. Ready. Hello, little fuckers, and welcome back to your new favorite channel. Ooh. During this video, we're gonna talk about one fetish that we actually find that it's really, really interesting. We actually love to do this kind of research, but this one, it seems so, so interesting to me at least because I cannot, I just cannot. Before going at it, I'm gonna ask you a few questions, you guys. We should not overwhelm that yet. Yes, not yet. Uh, first of all, I wanna know, do you like being tickled? Have you ever caught yourself fantasizing or thinking about how nice it is to be tickled or tickle someone else? Let's get to it. So dirty, but you love so sweet. Okay, we are gonna go deep on this, but first of all, how are you doing? How are you doing? I'm doing good. What about you? Good. I'm doing good, although I need a haircut. You look cute. Oh. Uh, <laughs> yeah, remember we are in China. Okay, thank you. Ali asked you before, how do you feel with tickles? But how about you? Do okay. you like tickles? Do you enjoy tickles? Okay, so personal, it makes me super, super anxious. Overall, mm, it's not my thing. What are you? you oh. Are you talking from a... Uh, sexual way or you have never tried I have I, okay okay to be fair okay. I have I have never tried but I don't think that I will really enjoy it what about you I just think about tickles and I start getting nervous because it reminds me of when I was a kid don't get out of here <laughs> it reminds me of when I was a kid my brother used to love to tickle me why I don't know I just guess because he let's knew let's call him hey. oh I thought you were gonna tickle me <laughs> I think this interview we're gonna be quite nervous because yeah. maybe it's tickle you no. okay whatever let's go deep to this we are gonna talk today about knismolegnia knismolegnia this is a word that took us time to remember yeah we needed to practice for you guys this is called knismolegnia and it's the practice about being aroused while being tickled while you tickle someone or by watching other people tickling each other do you think you will get aroused while watching people tickling each other I never thought about that, but it's actually a good question. Maybe, maybe that will work for me. Not tickling someone, not being tickled, but watching people, maybe it will work. Wow! <laughs> nothing, no it's judging. It's not weird. This is a no judging corner. <laughs> I'm not judging. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, Nismalegnia is the soft practice of tickling. Wait. Soft? There, yeah. You mean there's a... There is another practice that is the heavy tickling. Oh no. Okay, I'm out. We have done this research and it can be considered a part inside of the BDSM. Like, have you ever heard or watched these videos where they are like tied up with ropes or... Well, someone knows about <laughs> this. I don't know about I this mean, I did my heavy research. practice. Okay, you did your research, good girl. <laughs> we have to differentiate the two names. The light practicing is called nismolegnia, and the hard practice is called gorgolesis. Huh? Gorgolesis. Gorgonzola. <laughs> <laughs> Gorgolesis. Sorry. So the first one is nismolegnia, the second one is gorgolesis. Where huh? does these names come from? An idea? Well, I have no idea. These names. Nismolegnia. It was okay. <laughs> so this name Nismolegnia. It was well established in 1897 by two psychologists from the states that they found out through a patient that he was into this. I mean, I just think this is a little bit crazy because if I feel like I don't know anything about this fetish and I find it not that common. Mm -hmm. What would two psychologists in 1897 think about this? Well, maybe, maybe they like it. <laughs> maybe it was not that uncommon then. 
And that's true. We have to remember all the time there are two parts in the fetish of the ticklish. The first one is mismolegnia and the second one is gargalesis. Mismolegnia is the soft, gargalesis is the hard. Do you think is it safe to practice this? Well, probably it is. It actually is. We did our research and we actually find out that this practice is pretty safe. Espera, espera. You need to pee? You need to pee? Mm -hmm. sí. You need to pee? Okay. Sorry guys, I needed to pee. Where were we? Is it safe to practice gurgleses? Well, actually, yes, it's pretty safe because no fluids are being exchanged, first of all. And second of all, you cannot get like damaged, like permanently scarred or damaged because of it, unless you get punched or kicked as a response of someone being tickled or you being tickled. How about if you are tied up? Well, maybe you will find another way to defend yourself. Okay. <laughs> okay. Despite the fact that it's actually pretty safe, we find out that through the history, there were some reports of people dying because of it. What? But they didn't die because of this practice. They died because they... Uh, no. Because they have like... They, they, they had pretty, pretty bad health and they decided to go and do this. That's why we recommend Whenever you want to try this practice, start with the nismolegnia, yeah. don't go straight for gargalism. If your health is not very, very good, start with the soft practice, nismolegnia. Okay. Oh, I got it! I got it! You yeah. got it! Have five! Yeah! <laughs> no. no. Okay, okay, okay. I have an idea. No, wait. Before moving to whatever your head is preparing to punish me, of course, we need to say that it's actually re really, really rare, but possible, that whenever you're practicing this, you are gonna be obviously laughing, right? So when you're laughing so hard, you're, you might faint. Okay, right? are you talking about when you're laughing like ha 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 hard? Or ha ha ha, like laughing super hard. I don't know what you're thinking, obviously. But you I said mean, when, if you are laughing super hard, you can laugh with a boner. I mean, you understand me, right? When you're laughing, wherever you're hard or not. Happy? Laughing. Yeah. Okay, Happy. laughing. When you're laughing so much. Okay. Okay. okay, I think it's important to clarify this part. Okay, thank you, thank you, Iker, for your notes. I got an idea, mm. I got an idea. How about we play rock, scissors, paper? Mm -hmm. Rock, scissors, paper. Up to three. The loser is gonna be tickled by the other for 10 seconds. Mm -hmm. What? Well, maybe I'm I gonna lose. lose. I think I, I always lose in this kind of game. Dude, have you ever played with me? Yeah. Yeah, I always lose. That's true. Ready? 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 No. Okay, okay. Please, please. <laughs> rock, scissors, paper. Rock, scissor, paper! Ah! Rock, scissor, paper! Ah! 3-0? Are you serious? No! No! No, I'm not gonna do that. Well, you're gonna no, kick me with it's, that? No, it's, 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 it's nismolegnia, right? It's gonna, be, it's gonna be the soft one. It's nismolegnia. <laughs> so, okay, you, I count down. Why are you going no, further? Lie, lie, lie. No. Come here. No. She lost! You lost. Yeah, but I see you very comfy in the corner. I don't like this. You lost, oh, little. Oh no, this is making me. What's so wrong nervous. with this girl? I don't like tickles. I don't like tickles. Little fucker, get ready. Three. Put your hands up. No. Put them in the back. No. How are you gonna have any practice if you're not willing to let here, me? Here, here, here. Yeah, here. 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 Ah! <laughs> don't touch me. Here. A little bit chickenish. No. Chickenish. No. <laughs> no stop. See, don't. Here. No. Open your arms. No. Okay. No. You count ten. No. What's wrong with this girl, you little? Que, que ya estoy, que, I'm already I'm, extremely I'm, anxious. Yeah, you're, you know? she's getting nervous, and I didn't even start. It's I'm just sweating. ten I'm seconds. Gonna That's another <laughs> topic. We will talk another time. Ready? Ten. <laughs> Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Okay, okay. I give you two seconds for free. 
Okay, thank you. You're so kind. You're so nice. I'm so nice, right? Well, I'm seeing you. <laughs> so, <clears throat> you got it, girl. Get it, girl. <laughs> Do it, girl. <laughs> oh. Oh. I have come to put the AC. She cannot handle after the 10 seconds. Yeah, no, no. I have That's a question cool. for this little And the question I is, did you get aroused? No, I didn't. Okay, so okay, this obviously it's not for me. I don't know how people do it. Seriously, total respect, kudos to people who actually enjoy this. A lot of courage. It's not my yeah. Like most fetishes, it's really hard to find numbers and like raw information because we are still living in a world where taboos and other stigmas and other factors affect the way we tell our information. It's not so easy for people to respond an interview or a questionnaire about their sex lives. It's so hard to share your intimate life and pour it into some computer or some paper. Would you do it? Well, it depends if it's for the sake of research and scientific findings, maybe yes. Would you do it for the channel? Maybe, I mean, Ooh. well, okay, okay, that's another story, okay? Let's okay. focus. As I just said, it's really hard to find raw numbers, but we did find some information. For me, it was really shocking. For example, if you go to your browser and you type tickle porn, you are actually gonna come up with almost a million hits. What? Right? A, a million? million? Yeah, almost a million. So this means that it's not as uncommon as we thought. One of those sites, we we actually enter one of those sites just for the sake of this we research. We didn't get the membership No, yet. not yet. I mean, not the VIP. This site is called onlytickling.com and well, it was really pretty. It was a really pretty setup, like the website, it was actually really cute. It featured like two girls laughing so comfortably, tickling each other. That took they some courage because I wouldn't be able to pretend that I'm happy. By the way, it's not just about this site that we, for example, just said. Do you know what Tinder is? So for those that don't know what Tinder is, this is a dating, dating flirting, up we find the equivalent for the tickling so this is called tickledate.com and is the interface of dating app for people into tickling, tickling. <laughs> <laughs> why don't you try and tell us what you think have you ever feel aroused by being tickled have you ever feel aroused by tickling someone do you enjoy when you tickle someone tell us little fucker. tell us us well, well, information us right here Thank you very much for watching this video. If you thought it was interesting, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you very much, little and see you soon. Bye-bye.